Hello, I'm Peter Harding, President of Unesda Soft Drinks Europe and CEO of Suntory Beverage and Food International. The last week saw a massive number of European farmers taking to the streets of several EU countries. From Romania to Portugal, farmers have been protesting over high costs and impact on revenues. But it's not only farmers that are showing widespread discontent. Citizens and businesses are equally concerned about what the future holds and all seek dialogue and effective solutions from policymakers. In this context, the new EU political term is a critical opportunity for Europe to recalibrate its response to today's challenges, both within our continent and globally. Together, we need to navigate a complex economic and political landscape while addressing the pressing climate challenges. It's no easy task, but the EU can support us by prioritizing ambitious yet realistic and enabling policies that are based on proper impact assessments and continuous dialogue with all stakeholders. It's time to reflect on what has been achieved and the impact of existing measures, to assess what remains to be done and to focus on targeted actions. Policymakers cannot continue with business as usual. We, the European soft drink sector, believe in the opportunities that lie ahead and in the power of collaboration to achieve further progress. Our manifesto reflects our strong commitment to driving wider positive change for the environment, consumers and businesses. We have a bold vision centered on three key pillars. One, health and nutrition. We aim to foster balanced diets with our intensified actions to reduce sugar in our soft drinks and promote responsible marketing practices. Two, the environment. We also aim to further drive environmental sustainability across our supply chain. And number three, competitiveness. We will strive to cement our position as a globally competitive sector, a pillar of the European economy. We are proud to be a driver for economic growth. We support over 1.8 million jobs in Europe, both directly and throughout our value chain, a value chain that is estimated to be worth 242 billion euros annually. We will remain a constructive sector, offering evidence-based solutions and collaborating with all stakeholders, including policymakers, to drive further positive change. I encourage you all to explore our manifesto and stay engaged with the ongoing initiatives that our sector is implementing across Europe.